414 reports. Made 247 traffic arrests, which included four DUI arrests and 104 criminal arrests. That's all I have, sir. Thank you, Rocco. Uh, next, we have Harlem High School student, uh, Leosan Abraham Herrera. I'm extremely excited to uh, announce that on the April 2nd, uh, Little Free Libraries, in partnership with uh, Harlem High School, or I should say Harlem School District, and Grace Lutheran Church, were able to be unveiled uh, that, uh, I believe it was a Thursday morning. And we were able to uh, place these three Little Free Libraries inside Harlem High School. Uh, once the weather clears up, we're going to be able to take those outside and place those. Essentially what this is, is that each and every little free library is a little box. And within this box, you fill it up with books, a uh, different selection of books, which uh, different travelers or passerbys can borrow a book or two from. And essentially, you can borrow a book and then you can give it back. So it's a gift that keeps on giving, essentially. And we're trying to promote literacy in the area. I know that Mayor Bolin is trying to get this up and running in the community. And uh, this organization called Little Free Libraries is online. So it's www.littlefreelibraries.org. Essentially, when you build one, you're able to uh, send a picture of your Little Free Library. And then you'll be getting a plaque that says, uh, leave a book, get a book and then you'll get one that says the Little Free Libraries. Um, so what Mayor Bolin is trying to do is he's trying to get other homeowners to join the uh, movement around the area. And other than that, I think it's just spring sports are in full swing right now. So thank you very much, Your Honor. Thank you, Abraham. And Abraham did an outstanding speech uh, when we had the ribbon cutting. So I thought he did a fine job, young man. Thank you. Go ahead and give him a hand. <laughs> Uh, next, we have committee and trustee reports. Uh, I'll start over here. Trustee Kidd. Sage, I would like to say congratulations. Your dad's a good man. I would like to, you have to know that he spent thousands of students at Harlem High School through wrestling and probably tens of thousands of hours on the wrestling mat. And your character shows. So congratulations, and it's always good to see another Hecox. Thank you, Trustee Kidd. Trustee Snodgrass. Um, thank you. I would just like to um, encourage the other trustees to take part in the um, State Illinois Comptroller Judy Bartopinka's Follow the Money. Um, I met with them. It's going to be at Rock Valley College Stenstrom Center. I registered today, and I think it would be a great opportunity for all of us to learn something more about following the money. I know um, the people from Judy's office were extremely excited that the Lee County people were coming. <laughs> so. Um, for various reasons. And then I also wanted to let you know that on April 25th, um, State um, um, Jesse Jackson, um, what's his, what is his name? I'm sorry, Jesse White, yes, I'm so sorry, um, will be here and he is promoting his donor awareness and will be having a sign up for tissue and blood donors that day. And then lastly, I wanted to announce, um, we're very excited at Rock Valley College. At one o'clock tomorrow, we're announcing who our new president will be. So um, be looking for that announcement tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you, Trustee Snodgrass. Trustee Beck. Thank you, Your Honor. Uh, this evening, the Administration and Finance Committee met, approved uh, warrants, uh, revert, uh, and uh, approved one ordinance and three resolutions, which will go to the a April 24th uh, board for consideration. All of those are with a positive recommendation. Thank you. Thank you, Trustee Beck. Trustee Yo. Thank you, Your Honor. Tonight's uh, Planning and Economic Development Committee met and passed one ordinance that will be moved forward to the April 21st board meeting. Thank you, Trustee Yo. Is there any more reports? I see none. <coughs> the next item for consideration is the consent agenda. Are there any items that a trustee would like removed from the consent agenda to be considered separately? Trustee Kidd. Line E. Line E.
Is there any other items to be removed from the consent agenda? I entertain a motion to approve the consent agenda A, B, C, D, and F. So made. Second. I have a motion and a second. Could I have staff report, please? Thank you, Mayor. Item A is Ordinance 6-14, a special use permit for the GPS church uh, to operate a farmer's market. This is the second and final reading. Item B is Ordinance 8-14, a zoning map amendment changing the zoning from ag to commercial for 1312 Prairie Lane for Mr. Langley. And this is also the second and final reading. <coughs> Item C is resolution 21 R14, authorization to purchase two squad cars from Landmark Ford. Item D is resolution 22 R14, award of the village-wide curbs curbside waste collection contract to Rock River uh, Disposal Incorporated for a period of five years. Item F is resolution 24R14, authorization to bid Colonial, Queen Oaks, and Ramona reconstruction, uh, and that will be conducted by McMahon Engineering. Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Tim. Is there any discussion? I see none. Will the clerk take roll call, please? Trustee Tammon. Aye. Kidd. Aye. Wilson. Aye. Yo. Aye. Beck. Aye. Snodgrass. Aye. Mayor Boland. Aye. Seven ayes and no nays. Consent agenda items A, B, C, D, and F has been approved. Next we have resolution 23-R-14, release closed session minutes. I'll entertain a motion to adopt. So made. Second. I have a motion and a second. Could I have staff report, please? Tom, you want to do the report? Uh, sure. The, um, every six months, the um, municipality is required to review its closed session minutes. Uh, we did that last week. Uh, all trustees have had an opportunity to come in and review the closed session minutes and the resolution that is presented Tonight has a list of uh, several closed session minutes to be released. Thank you, Attorney Green. Is there any discussion? I see none. Would the clerk take roll call, please? Trustee Kidd? Nay. Wilson? Aye. Yo? Aye. Beck? Aye. Snodgrass? Aye. Tammon? Aye. Mayor Boland? Aye. Six ayes, one nay. Resolution 23-R-14 has been adopted. Next, we have new business ordinance 11, pardon me, 11-14, annual budget for year 2014-2015 for the first reading. I'll entertain a motion to approve. So made. Second. I have a motion and a second. Could I have staff report, please? The budget ordinance is before you as um, outlined in the memo. The discussion items that were um, discussed during the budget workshop have been taken into account. I did provide a summary of changes by line item to take those changes into account. And it all has resulted in a balanced budget. If you have any further <coughs> questions, let me know. Thank you. Thank you, Michelle. Is there any discussion? <coughs> Will the clerk take roll call, please? Trustee Wilson? Aye. Yo? Aye. Beck? Aye. Snodgrass? Aye. Tammon? Aye. Kidd? Nay. Mayor Boland? Aye. Six ayes, one nay. Ordinance 11-14, annual budget for year 2014-2015, first reading has been approved. Next we have public comment. If you have a comment, please step to the podium, state your name and address, and keep your comments to three minutes, please. While you're coming to the podium, uh, I just want to tell you, we do not address questions directly and address or state your comments to the chair. Yes. yes. Thank you, Mayor. Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. Actually, I'm sorry for being late here. I'm keeping it on a beautiful circuit, uh, but uh, you're right about having uh, 
smart people, Chesney Park, people house of bus, know more than my GPS. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're getting ready for the 26th Great American Cleanup. Thanks for the proclamation. This is our 26th year. We have 20 locations around the county where people are working on the sites that day to uh, volunteers to go out and clean up the city. We furnish all the bags, uh, the pickup, all the equipment, everything is for you. I uh, sign up, you can go online, fill a sheet out, clubs, organizations, churches, groups. Uh, we will have 1,500 people pick up over 50 tons of litter in about three hours on that day there. Uh, it's kind of our gift to the community. I can imagine what it costs your public works enough, 1,500 people on a Saturday. But anyway, I want to thank you very much, and, uh, and every day is Thursday. Thank you. Thank you. Is there anybody else wish to have a public comment? I see none. I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. I have a motion and a second. All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? We are adjourned.